a small village in the southeastern Maharashtra has gained the alliance of Manav Lok, who have taken up an initiative to educate the farmers about contemporary agricultural practices. Land in this region is inclined, as a result of which all the flowing rainwater gets accumulated in the lower region. The flowing water also carries away the rich topsoil along with it. To ensure uniform water percolation, level land is necessary. The uneven land can be leveled effortlessly by deploying a laser leveler. The laser leveler takes a few trips to level the surface. It scrapes the surface at some sites and deposits the soil at the other. Ultimately, the entire field is leveled. Next step for land preparation is ploughing, in which the top soil is turned in the daylight so as to enable the birds to feed on insects that are exposed to the surface. With the falling sun rays, the ploughed soil gets nourished with hummus and other nutritions. Mild showers softens the large chunk of soil which are then crushed down by the cultivator. The small chunks of soil are blended using a rotavator to ensure the land to be ready for cultivation. Soya bean, being a major Kharif crop, is sown into the soil using a seed driller. ADM has promoted a new research as per which if the seeds are sown by broadbed furrow machines, farmers will require 8 kg less seeds per acre of land. Using a boom sprayer, the budding soya bean plants get their vaccination against pests and insects. Traditionally, a farmer carries the burden of a backpack sprayer and spends a lot of efforts to spray the pesticide over the crops. Many a times, farmers are negligent about protecting themselves from accidentally inhaling harmful pesticides. A farmer ensures the safety of his crops after long hours of repetitive filling of the pesticide container, whereas the entire process can be simplified using the mechanized methodology. Using a boom sprayer, crops over one acre of land can be made pest-free in just 10 minutes with all safety precautions. The soya bean ripen with the chilling winters. Again going by the traditional way, a farmer may take an entire day to manually harvest the crops. However, a mild fall may rot the crops. Instead, using a harvester eases out the entire tedious process when reaping, threshing and sacking are done simultaneously. The harvest leftover are allowed to decay over time until the season for the next rabi crop arrives. Zero-till drill machines enables farmers to skip the ploughing process and directly sow seeds in the row space between decayed crops in order to prevent moisture content in the soil. By going the mechanized way, a farmer can save up to rupees 2,900 per acre of land. We at Manolo facilitate reforms so as to enable them transform.